Welcome everyone to this exciting NBA exhibition game here in Boston. The visiting team will square off against the home team. I'm Kevin Harlan here with Kenny Smith. Craig Sigler will join us later on. Now as we get set, T-Mobile presents the starting five lineups. And without further ado, it looks like they're setting up for the tip-off. Nowitzki hands it off. Passes it to the high post. To Ginobili. Parker. They need to get off a shot. Feeds it to Peja. Here's Nowitzki. Duncan snatches the defensive rebound. Nowitzki, you gotta hand it to the defense. They put the pressure on him, and the shot was off the mark. What a pass! Here comes the double team. Left corner, shoots it. The three-pointer was no good by Carter. Carter is a guy you expect to hit those. That shot was a gimme. Dishes it to Yao. Dirk tosses it up. Off target on the 15-footer. Nowitzki got just the kind of look he was hoping for. Sometimes they just don't fall. Leads him with the pass. Bach flushes it with the one-handed jam. The home team to first blood. This should be a good game. Time for the Gatorade around the cooler update. Let's go to our sideline reporter, Craig Sig. Craig? Well, I had a moment to speak with Roger Jones, coach of the home team. When I asked him about his game plan, he told me, we want to attack the rim and see if we can get some easy buckets and trips to the line. Sounds like they feel like they can get the upper hand down low. Well, with their athleticism, it sounds like a good plan. No question, Ken. With the new hand check enforcement, you've got to take advantage and get to the rack. Seven on the shot clock. Ram by Yao. Rises and dishes. Is such a diehard defender. Every time he steps on the court, he's on a mission to lock you down. If you've got a foul, you've got to get your money's worth. Those three-point plays are backbreaking. He completes the three-point play. Duncan inbounds the ball. Paul brings it up the court. Isolates. Leads him in. Bach spiked away. Took it at the big guy and got it shut down. It seems like the bigger you are, the more guys want to dunk on you. It's like a notch in their belt. Well, this time they paid the penalty. That's right. Well, he did a great job to absorb the contact and still knock it down. Heck of a play. Good for the three-point play. The home team looking for a basket to put an end to this run. Yeah, they need a bucket soon before this gets out of hand. Up high and down hard. Let's check out that replay with the strike slam cam. Paul made a beautiful feed inside. Good pass and really breaks down the deep. Ginobili has it on the perimeter. Seven on the shot clock. Rips it down. The home team will take their first time out of the game. Duncan inbounds the ball. It's a six-point game. The swing pass to Bosch. Last shot laid in by Duncan. Kenny, when, when you're ranking power forwards in the history of the NBA, where, where is Tim Duncan like? Got to be right up there at the top, Kev, no doubt. You can mention Malone maybe. Barkley from a number standpoint. But when you add up all the rings, that puts Timmy over the top. 
Stojakovic got right to the rack because the D totally lost track of him. D'Anthony. Carter. Crosses it over. Opposing players get uneasy when he's got the ball in his hands. He always seems to make the right decision to get his team a bucket. They're D'ing up man to man. Swings it to Yao. Gets it on the elbow. Stojakovic dishes it to Ginobili. Yao dumps it off to Peja. Yao hands it to the perimeter. That last shot was drained by Parker. Great delivery with the bounce pass. He kept it away from the D and set up the shot perfectly. Duncan inbounds the ball. To Carter. Duncan snatches the offensive rebound. Right wing dishes to the outside. To Duncan. Shoots it up. Nice pump fake to set up the triple by Carter. Put the ball in his hand and good things will happen for you. He's so dangerous. Parker passes it to Yao. Throws it up. No good on the baseline, Jay. The home team have it, and it's a one-possession game. Yao might have rushed that shot, but he was trying to put it up before the D could react. Out left, passes it to Duncan. Six seconds to shoot. Anthony gets it outside. The feed to Carter. It bounces out of bounds after the shot. Nowitzki inbounds the ball. Isolates. Pass outright. To Parker. Shot clock winding down. Stiakovich. Misses the tough shot. Paul passes it up court. Swings it to Duncan. Gets it on the perimeter. Anthony dishes it to Duncan. Releases. Nails it from eight feet. Oh, man. He's so good at scoring on that low block. No question, Kenny. He just knows his way around the basket. Parker takes it up. Paul is on it. The D was lurking on that one. It was just barely enough to throw it off. Paul passes it to the wing. Six seconds to shoot. To Carter. Does not get the go-ahead bucket. Leads him with the pass. Oh, great stop. When you attack a great defender, you got to come with something better than that. They need to get off a shot. Outside, here's Ginobili. Nails the train. Absolutely deadly from three-point range. Oh, you said it, Kev. This is not the guy to sag off on defensively. He'll make you pay every time. Passes it to the wing. Anthony backs down. Goes up. Streaks it past him with an up and under. Anthony made the D a non-factor on that one. He's so quick, he can get position on you in a blink of an eye. Yao inbounds the ball. To Stojakovic, Ginobili. Six seconds to shoot. Dishes it to Yao. Snaps the net. Assisted by 
Ginobili. Just over four minutes left in the first. Left side, the layup was tossed in by Carter. I'll tell you, Kevin, both teams have been on a tear. This is going to be a high-scoring game. Straight man-to-man -man D here. Dishes to Yao for three. Cashed in by Manu. Paul brings it up the floor. He got the ball inside, and with the defense closed in, he just kicked it out to the open man. Now that's a great play. Dicey pass. Nice pass. Yao has it right wing. The pass to Manu. Seven on the shot clock. Passes out left to Peja. Duncan corrals it, and that's his fourth rebound thus far. Carter passes it back to Paul. Shot clock winding down. Anthony crosses it over. Anthony is down on the court. You may have hurt his knee. Oh, that's rough. Kevin, this is one aspect of the game you never want to see. Hopefully the injury isn't too severe, and he'll be able to return to action soon. We wish him the best. We'll monitor that situation and provide an update on his condition when one is forthcoming. Both teams are going to make some substitutions. He gets them both. Gasol inbounds the ball. Ginobili dumps it off. Gets it down low. Gasol shoots. Oh, barely misses the shot, but he'll go to the line for two. And he makes the first one. Well, both teams are going to make some substitutions. And he splits the free throws. Bosch passes it up court. Looks to break his man down. Here's Brand. Oh, cool. Corrals the miss off the defensive glass. Parker feeds it to Manu. Parker hands it to the right. To Ginobili. Releases from 15. Bosch snatches it off the glass. That's a big man. He doesn't need a ladder to clean those windows. Perimeter. Tries the spin move. The last layup was dropped in by Felton. Felton has that extra gear, and that makes him so dangerous. He can turn it on and just blow by defender. Passes it to the top of the key. Takes it up. Well, they prevented the dunk, but there's a whistle, and he'll head to the line. Squads will make some substitutions. Get some both. Boozer inbounds the ball. 140 left in the first. To Boozer. Carter. Connects! His scoring ability is so valuable, Kevin. He's a guy you can rely on to make shots. Let's go. 
backs in. Gasol takes the turnaround. Jay Rand tosses it up court. He's got a sweet jumper for a big man, doesn't he? He does. That makes him much tougher to guard because he doesn't have to be right under the basket to make shots. Dumps it to Boozer. Outside. Here's Howard. No luck on the three-point attempt. Had enough space, Cap. That saddle he'll hit more often than not. The handoff to O'Curr. The home team could opt for the quick shot here. That would leave him with the final possession. Passes it to Carter. Goes up. Beautiful teardrop finish by Brand. He's got such an impressive array of moves in the low post. They've got to throw the double team at him. He's too dangerous down low. The dish to Barbosa. Bounce pass. Perimeter. Seven on the shot clock. To Gasol. Banks it home. Tremendous mid-range shooting ability. Yeah, that satin jumper of his makes him a serious threat on offense. Rand puts it up. That's the end of the first quarter. We're at the end of one. The score, 29 to 25. The away team have taken the early lead. Well, they're moving the ball around beautifully. And when you keep everyone involved, good things happen. Duncan inbounds it to start the second quarter. Bosch. Dishes it to Brand. Gets it left wing. They need to get off a shot. With the crossover. Paul, no look pass to Bosch. That last shot netted for three. He's got range, Kevin. You don't expect a big man to exhibit that kind of three-point shooting ability. Anthony was injured earlier in the game. Let's check in with Craig Sager for an injury update. Craig, what do you have? Good news from the team doctor. There doesn't seem to be any permanent damage to the knee. Just a little soreness and swelling. There's still a chance he'll return to the game. We'll see how he feels. Guys? Thanks, Craig. Anthony was having some knee soreness, but he's subbing back in. He'll give it a shot. Dirk inbounds the ball. They need to get off a shot. And it's rebounded by Duncan. Stoyakovic got a good look at that one and has to be a little upset at himself. That's his shot. Paul. Wings it to the right wing. One on one. Five on the shot clock. Here's Paul. Off target. The D caught a little bit of a break on that. That was an awfully good shot. It just didn't go in. To Dirk. Got a piece of it. And it's gathered up by Duncan. The home team looking for their first lead of the game. Nice interception. He knew where that pass was going before it was even thrown. Right wing. Bosch backs him down. Takes it up. Gets the bucket and the foul. Fantastic concentration to get that shot off. That couldn't have been easy. Both teams are making substitutions. Good for the three-point play. Nowitzki inbounds the ball. Parker crosses it over to tie it up. Offensive rebound grabbed by Parker. I like aggressive defense, but there was too much contact there for the refs not to blow the whistle. Beautiful job to maintain control and sink the basket. Number 12 will head to the bench. No good, and they don't 
get the three-point play. We've got a tie ball game on our hands. Bounces it to the high post. With the crossover to Duncan. The steal by the home team. Bad pass. It almost looked like he meant to throw it to the defender. Yao feeds it to Barbosa. Great delivery with the bounce pass. He kept it away from the D and set up the shot perfectly. Outside. Dishes to Paul. Anthony fires from the right block. Yao gets the board inside. Parker gets it on the perimeter. The swing pass to Stojakovic. Pass, perimeter. Shot clock winding down. To Stojakovic. Releases. It's money from deep. Nice bucket by the 10th year veteran out of Yugoslavia. Straight man to man D here. Bosch unloads, can't put an end to the run. Stojakovic hands it off to Parker, passes it to Dirk, gets it baseline. Barbosa dishes it to Parker. Dirk feeds it to the corner. The last tray was cashed in by Stojakovic. He loves that corner three, Kev. That's a shot I've seen him make time and time again. The home team will take a timeout. Got a quick breather, but they need him to get back on the floor. Bosch inbounds the ball. Sizing up his man. Here's Anthony. Money! The model just continues to mature and develop as a player. He opened a lot of eyes with his performance in Team USA in the World Championship. Yeah, he was their best player, the leading scorer, and he won their Athlete of the Year award. He just needs to keep applying himself, Kevin. There's no telling just how good he could be. And it's an eight-point game. Swings it to the left wing. To Carter. Stolen by the home team. The defender was at least two steps ahead on that pass. He knew exactly where the ball was going. Yao with the shot. Yao snatches it inside. Hammered in on that last dunk. Yao isn't going to win any dunk contest. But if you give him a chance, he'll happily throw it down on you. Bosch inbounds the ball. Just over seven minutes left in the half. Skips it to Anthony. Down low. Passes it to Duncan. That last shot buried from 14 feet. I can tell you that little separation from the defender makes a big difference. Case in point on that shot. Leads him in. Parker has it on the inside. Flipped up and in on that last layup. Great communication on that play. He streaked to the bucket, and the pass led him perfectly. The pass to Paul. Swing pass outside. Goes up. Led him to the bucket with the dish, and it's stuffed in by Bosch. Paul set him up perfectly with that bounce pass. He's got such good court vision. Nice dish by Parker. Assisted by Anthony inbounds the ball. Carter brings it up the floor. To
to Paul. Bosch backs in. It's a little short, but gets the friendly roll. He seems pretty confident in that hook. The D wasn't even close to blocking that one. Passes it to Manu. Gets it far side. Six seconds to shoot. Parker passes it to Stojakovic. That last 18-footer was off the mark. The last layup was dropped in by Nowitzki. Nowitzki knows how to use his size and just banged his way to the bucket. Great play. Paul dumps it to the paint. Duncan takes it up. Rips in the ferocious chain. Duncan was the beneficiary of some sloppy defensive play. That's too easy. To Manu, hits, nice pass, leading into the bucket. That's why you work the ball inside. Nice finish there. High post. Here's Carter. Yeah, reels in the defensive rebound. Lucky break for the D. If you leave shooters that open, they'll eventually make you pay. A steal by Anthony. Lead pass inside. To Carter. Hall. Dishes to Duncan. That last shot missed from 13. Was right in his face and forced to miss. He takes defense personally. He just hates to be scored upon. To the stripe, he's doubled up. Takes a three, drained by Manu. Nice shot by the six-year veteran out of Argentina. Duncan inbounds the ball. Under four minutes left in the second. Dishes to Carter. Pulls the trigger. Can't connect from the wing. Carter loves those mid-range pull-ups, but just couldn't bag it that time. Manu has it left wing. Buried by Nowitzki. They're showing no mercy. That lead just keeps growing. Paul brings it up the court. Sizing up his man. The lead pass to Paul. Flipped up and in on that last layup. Nice speed. Way to keep moving. Parker tosses it up court. Feeds out left to Dirk. Cans the shot. Well, that's the European style of play. When your bigs can hit the mid-range jumper, it can really open things up. They're d up man to man. Carter, from about 19 feet, Yao, way up court. The defense do not to leave him open for mid-range, and they did a pretty good job of pressuring that shot. Feeds it to Parker, gets it outside. Nowitzki tickles the twine. Dirk was last season's MVP, but he has more to prove than ever after a disappointing first round where he and the Mavs were dismantled by the Warriors. Yeah, difficult end to a terrific regular season. Well, he may have taken more than his fair share of criticism for it. His team just ran into a buzzsaw. Paul swings it to Anthony. Oh, beautiful pass. That last eight-footer was dropped in by Duncan. Put the ball in his hands and good things will happen for you. He's so dangerous. By yourself, by yourself. Parker skips it to the right side. Nowitzki from about 19 feet gets it to the fall. No answers on D. They can't do anything to stop him. 
125 left to the hand. To Carter. Perimeter. Bounces it to the high post. Six seconds to shoot. To Duncan. Yeah, got all of that one. That's his second block so far. I'm all for trying to get the best shot. But when the 24-second shot clock is down to the wire, you just got to chuck something up there. Ginobili inbounds the ball. Gasol. Here's Barbosa. Buries the triple. Leandro Barbosa, the sixth man of the year last season. And a candidate for most improved, too. He's just a perfect fit for the Sun style. Lightning quick with that deadly three-point shot. Yeah, he puts points up in a hurry. Another great draft pick for the Suns. Passes it to Anthony. Backs down. Bounces high, but falls through. Anthony is doing his best playing hurt, but it's got to be affecting his game somewhere. Parker passes it up court. Gasol gets it in the paint. Jams it in. That's just a power dunk, plain and simple. You gotta love it. Boozer inbounds the ball. The dump off to Anthony. The bounce pass to Boozer. Parker passes way down court. And that concludes the first half. The score, 67 to 49. That's a big lead. Yeah, it's definitely been a one-sided game so far. Now it's time for our T-Mobile halftime report. Yao has controlled the boards. He's our leading rebounder with eight. Ginobili is orchestrating the offense beautifully. And he's the assist leader with eight. Let's have a look at the team stats from the first half. The away team players have been able to score so easily that it seems almost effortless. Yeah, they're putting on a clinic out there, as you can see from their sky-high field goal percentage. Well, the second half will begin in just a few moments. Bosch inbounds it to start the second half. Carter. Hands it off. Skip pass. Baseline. Shoots. A fadeaway was hit by Duncan. Sweet touch by the 11th year veteran out of Wake Forest. The last shot laid gently in. I just love his tenacity on offense. He's lightning quick and loves to take it to the rack. To Yao. Tosses it up. Buries it from 14 feet. The defense was a little slow to set it up, and they got caught napping. Carter. One-on-one. -on -one. Tipped. And it's tracked down by the home team. Great reflexes. He pounced in and picked that one off easily. Dishes it to Yao. Backs him down. He's double teamed. Whoa! Throws down the reverse jam. Yao isn't going to win any dunk contest, but if you give him a chance, he'll happily throw it down on you. Nice second look with the Sprite Slam Cam. Now for the Gatorade Around the Cooler update, let's check in with the third member of our team, Craig Sagan. Craig? Well, Kevin, as the visiting team came out for the second half, I spoke with Gerald Nash. He told me that they've done a good job of being aggressive and controlling the tempo of the game. He said, we found a rhythm from outside, and you can tell that the guys are having fun out there. We have a few things to work on, but I'm pleased with our play so far. They've certainly been a pleasure to watch in the first half. Kevin? They have indeed. Thank you, Craig Sager. What a pass! Yao backs in. The last layup, no good. Well, he doesn't have the softest touch, and with the D in his face, that made all the difference. Has it left wing. 
Paul passes it to Bosch. Seven on the shot clock. Anthony passes it to the wing. Raises up. Money on the jump shot. Nowitzki inbounds the ball. Parker with an assist. This trip up would have 10 for the game. To Yao. Backs him down. Couldn't wait to get a hand on that shot. We saw that coming all the way. Risky pass. Right side. Dishes to the right wing. To Duncan. Carter. Feeds it to Paul. Stolen away by Parker. Oh, quick hands. He grabbed the ball right out of the air, picked it off. The home team will take a timeout. Duncan has been firing up ill-advised contested shots all game. If I was coaching him, I'd sit him for a long while. Well, let's get back to the action. Anthony inbounds the ball. High post. Duncan backs down. Shoots it up. The bank shot won't fall. Leads him with the pass. Duncan got himself a decent look there, but he just couldn't make the most of it. Dirk fires. Yao grabs the rebound. Gets inside. Gets the bucket. He's lighting it up to no one's surprise. This guy's just a dynamite scorer. Dishes it to Paul. Backs in. Seven on the shot clock. Carter gets it on the corner. The last shot missed from three-point range. Limiting second-chance buckets is a hallmark of solid D. They're really controlling the board. The lob to Yao. Dishes outside. Isolates. To Yao. Bosch crams the rock. Bosch passes it to Duncan. That last 16 footer was off the mark. The defense couldn't have left him any more wide open. You've got to hit those shots. Manu passes it up court. Rises and dishes. Leads him with the pass. Anthony dumps it off to Carter. Shoots it. Cranes the open jumper. Nice bucket by the 10th year veteran out of North Carolina. Manu at the controls. Gets it baseline. Ginobili swings it to Stojakovic. Here's Parker. Hits back rim and out. To Anthony. Perimeter. Five on the shot clock. No look pass to the top of the key. The last shot good by Bosch. He can't be stopped. He's going out of control out there. Yao inbounds the ball. Manu brings it up. Stay with him, stay with him. To Dirk. Buries it. Kenny, wouldn't you say, I mean, more so now than ever, it's become a five-man game. I mean, we're seeing right now the less isolations and far more smooth offensive sets and everyone touching the ball, and, and it just seems like the five-man game now is, is the direction this league is headed. Absolutely. I think it's just what the game needed, Kevin. I think the reintroduction of the zone defense has forced coaches to be more creative on both ends. 
and has rewarded the more versatile team. Nowitzki. The hook. Duncan grabs it, and that's his eighth rebound of the contest. The big fella holds it in. This guy knows how to fight for a rebound. Dumps it to Carter. Fantastic concentration to get that shot off. That couldn't have been easy. Well, both teams will make some substitutions. He completes the three-point play. Gasol inbounds the ball. Ginobili with an assist. This trip would have a double-double. Perimeter. Passes it to Dirk. Shot clock winding down. With the clock winding down, it's ripped down for a defensive rebound by Duncan. Paul gets it on the perimeter. The feed to Carter. Six seconds to shoot. Crosses it over. Grant from about 19 feet. Sinks it. They're on a nice run here, but they still have a ways to go to tie it up. Stojakovic sinks it. Stojakovic can really fill it up. It's a good idea to keep getting him the ball. Duncan inbounds the ball. They're Ding up man to man. Carter dumps it off. Switch up, switch up. Looks to break his man down. Here's Carter. Graceful finish. They turn the tables. Their hustle at both ends has gotten them back in this one. Oh, terrific pass. Seven on the shot clock. Gasol backs down. Takes it up. Oh! Rips him the ferocious jam. Gasol brought the hammer down. Oh, I'm speechless. Passes, top of the key. The up and under. Reeled in by Ginobili. That's his third rebound of the contest. Hands it off. To Dirk. It falls short. Nowitzki is suffering through a serious dry spell. That's just how it goes. Sometimes you're hot, sometimes you're not. Great pass. Bruce rips it down with one hand. He's not the greatest athlete, but he's got the length to stuff it home when he gets inside. Stojakovic. They need to get off a shot. Backs him down. Gasol takes the shot. Can't hit from the post. Leads him in. Intercepted. Nice interception. He knew where that pass was going before it was even thrown. Lead pass to Gasol. Well, he did a great job to absorb the contact and still knock it down. Heck of a play. making substitutions. Good for the three-point play. Duncan inbounds the ball. Come on, 
has it outside. Anthony passes it to Carter. Shot clock winding down. Grant backs him down. Off target on that last layup. No, sir. It ain't easy, son. Especially with a top-notch defender breathing right down your neck. Manu dishes it to the perimeter. To Gasol. Throws it up. Knocks it down from the right block. Your best bet is to deny him on that position. Once he gets inside of you, you've already lost that battle. Switch, baby, switch. Carter tosses it up court. Last shot laid in by Brand. Elton Brand, a somewhat unheralded star, right here in the bright lights of LA. Yeah, he hasn't gotten the recognition he deserves over the years, but he never makes a fuss about it. He just keeps playing spectacular basketball. That's right. Here's Gasol. Almost a three-point opportunity. Instead, he'll go to the line for two. Shooting two. He can't hit the first. Both teams will make some substitutions. Sinks the second. Wallace inbounds the ball. Feeds it to the outside. To Brand. Six seconds to shoot. That's down. Dangerous pass behind the back. The layup was finished by Howard. Howard took it behind his back and still had the skill to keep control for the layup. That's too sweet, Kevin. Gasol. They need to get off a shot. Lays it right in. He's got a sky-high field goal percentage, and that's because he's working hard to get those good looks. Hands it to Wallace. Releases. Nails the turnaround jumper. Way to square up off the quick turnaround. That's pretty. They'll probably hold for the last shot. The handoff to O'Kerr outside. Dishes it to Gasol. Number 12. Let's it go. Too much mustard on that one. Here's Howard. Misses the buzzer beater. We're at the end of the third, and it's a double-digit game. The score, 89-78. to 78. Yao has really gotten after it. And he's got a double-double. 17 points and 10 rebounds. No question. He's been a beast on the boards, Kevin. Some guys take over a game with their scoring. He's doing it on the glass. All right, the fourth quarter should begin momentarily. Asia inbounds it to start the fourth quarter. And now our sideline reporter, Craig Singer, has some information for us. Craig? Well, over the break, I listened in on the home team's huddle. Coach Jones was clearly fuming. He told them, you guys look like you're sleepwalking out there. He said, I don't know if you rolled out of the wrong side of the bed this morning or what. We've got to step it up right now. All right, thank you, Craig. Count the J by Dirk. Nice shot by the 10th year veteran out of Germany. Leads him with the pass. Oh, gets the lay-in. He's been in the zone, Kevin. If they can put it all together, they still might have a chance. Stoyakovic tosses it up court. The dish to Peja.
can't sink the first. Good on number two. Boozer inbounds the ball. Swing pass, perimeter. To Bart. Well, both teams have been on fire. The fans love this kind of game, Kevin. Stoyakovic. Count it. He starts that shot from above his head and fires it up in the blink of an eye. Yeah, it's even harder to face guard him because he brings his arm right in front of him. It's not a textbook motion, but it sure is effective. Passes it to Buzo. Has it on the elbow. Seven on the shot clock. Behind the arc. Hauled down inside by Felton. Anthony dishes to Bosch. Felton dumps it to the inside. The last layup was dropped in by Carter. Felton does a great job of seeing the floor. He led his man right to the bucket with that play. To Yao finishes with the soft touch. Yao made the most of that height advantage there on the inside and dropped it in. Looks to break his man down. Gorgeous pass. That last jump was slammed down by Anthony. He's got such a knack for finding the open man. Yeah, he picks defenses apart with absolute precision. Bold pass. Answered right back with the dunk by Yao. Yao isn't a great leaper, but when you're as tall as he is, you're bound to get a dunk now and then. Felton, nice move. Nobody expects him to be an intimidator. So when he gets a block, it motivates the whole team. Leads him in. Dirt flips it in for two. Nowitzki did a nice job there to keep the defense off balance. What a burst to the rim, and what a light touch. Leads him with the pass to the middle. Swings it to the perimeter. Crosses it over. Play the ball, play the ball. To Anthony Felton. Here's Bosch. It's off. Rises and dishes. Yao is feeling it out there. He's having a big game on the glass. Great hustle. Passes it to Yao. Stolen by the home team. Now that's sloppy. You have to thread the needle when you pass it inside. That wasn't even close. Baseline passes it to Carter. With the shot. Dirk. That's his fourth rebound thus far. Under eight minutes left to the fourth. Takes it up. Beautiful teardrop finish by Parker. Those teardrop running layups are so difficult to hit, but he made it look easy right there. Boozer gets it outright. The pass to Carter. That last triple off the mark. The away team with a nice lead. Yeah, they're playing well. Ginobili had a tough shot there. He can make those, but the D did just enough to alter the shot. Yao backs in. Flips it in for two. Sweet touch by the six-year veteran out of China. Bounce pass, right wing. To Felton, Anthony. Nice shot, stuck through for two. By the time the dude could react, it was way too late to stop him. That's how you explode for a dunk. 
Dirk inbounds the ball. About six and a half minutes left in the game. Seven on the shot clock. Passes it to Stojakovic. That miss isn't going to shake his confidence at all. He's not shy about those mid-range J's. Has it on the perimeter. Bosch hands it to Anthony. Felton dishes to the perimeter. Six seconds to shoot. Off target by Anthony. Parker brings it up. Anthony loves those mid-range pull-ups, but just couldn't bag it that time. To Nowitzki. Backs him down. Goes up. Carter corrals the miss inside. Anthony hands it off. Sizing up his man. Down low. Carter from just inside the arc. Parker on the rebound. Was right in his face and forced the miss. He takes defense personally. He just hates to be scored upon. Swings it to the outside. They need to get off a shot. Here's Stojakovic. Bosch reels it in. Well, that's still a good shot, Kev. The D was playing him a bit loose, and you got to keep him honest. Hart rips the core. Dirk inbounds the ball. To Stojakovic. Plays it right in. His scoring ability is so valuable, Kevin. He's a guy you can rely on to make shots. Felton hands it off to Anthony. Carter passes it to Felton. Six seconds to shoot. The tray. Yanked down inside by Dirk. The away team with a comfortable lead. The D got a little lucky there. They can't afford to play loose on that guy. Arcs it high. Chokes on the layup. To the elbow. Dishes it to Bosch. Felton gets it outside. The kick out to Carter. Shot clock winding down from deep. It falls. Vince Carter makes some amazing shots. Without a doubt, Kevin, with his length and leaping ability, he can always get that shot off. Then you factor in his great shooting touch, and you're bound to see some impressive shots. Manu at the controls. Pass, right wing. Yao backs down. On the money. Yao is just a natural when it comes to creating his shot. A tough, tough guy to guard. To Carter. Hooked away. And they grab the rock. He read that pass just like a book. He was all over. Last basket on the mark by Manu. Anthony inbounds the ball. For a contact sport, basketball requires plenty of finesse. An elegant finger roll like that one is perfect example of it. Yao has been attacking the rim with ferocity. They need to do a better job of keeping him out the paint. inbound the ball. Howard. Backs in. Dishes it 
to Anthony. Seven on the shot clock. Gets it right wing. Offline. Okur passes it up court. No Sioni. Lead pass to number 12. Takes it up. Tries to drop it in, but it won't go. Number 12 was here in those footsteps. He wasn't wide open, but that's a shot he's supposed to make. Felton feeds it to the outside. That last three-pointer was missed by Howard. The away team should slow it down here and use some clock. Howard doesn't often miss wide open shots like that. The D lucked out. To occur. Seven on the shot clock. Isolates. Terrific pass. Last shot laid in by Nocioni. Barring a complete meltdown, it looks like this is a walkaway win. Outside. Anthony goes up. Another block. They're just racking them up. The away team with a comfortable lead. Swings it to the perimeter. To be a drench. That last shot was dug down. The home team called time, and they've got one left. Set to inbound the ball. Both squads will make some substitutions. Who's inbounds the ball? Wallace. It's in. One oh eight left in the game. Number twelve was out of bounds there. That will cost them possession. It's like this. If you want to stay on the court, then stay on the court. Those lines aren't hard to see. Passes it to Boozer. Here's Cassell. Lays it in. Sweet time to lead into the rack. Cassell got a step on the D and worked inside for an easy layup. Forty-six seconds left in the game. Stay winning, stay winning. Passes it to Okur. Six seconds to shoot. Takes it up. Wallace grabs the rebound inside. Under a minute to go, and the game is all but over. Rises and dishes. Last shot dunked down by Boozer. As tall as he is, he's not known as a dunker. Still, he got his on that one. Okur inbounds the ball. 16 seconds left to the fourth. The away team walk away with a double-digit victory as they defeat 115-99. Their win belied by the close stat line. Yeah, Kev, they were just a hungrier team. You won't find a column on the stat sheet for desire, but when it's all said and done, that passion to win is the most crucial element. True enough. Yao is the Jordan brand player of the game, and he was impressive. Well, his hard work on the glass was crucial to their victory, Kevin. He did a great job of battling down low. All right, let's take a look at the hot zones. Well, that's it for us. On behalf of Kenny Smith and Craig Sig, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for tuning in to NBA Basketball on 2K Sports.